Oi, tudo bem? É a sua professora de português. Hello, everything is okay? I am your Portuguese teacher. We are now in lesson two, and we are going to learn two verbs that in Portuguese are different than in English. English has only one translation to be. Verbo ser e estar. They translate the same, only one thing in English to be. But in Portuguese, verbo ser is used for specific situations and verbo estar for other situations. Then let's start learning how to conjugate verbo ser. Verbo ser means to be is conjugate following this sequence. You need the personal pronoun and then you conjugate the verb. Then eu means I. If you want to say I am, you say eu So This is am. In English, you do not need the personal, you do need the personal pronoun, eu, but in Portuguese, not all the time you need. Instead of saying, eu sou Mrs. Berry, I can say, so Mrs. Berry. I can eliminate completely, eu. Oh, you cannot do that in English. That's the way my professors told me. You cannot do that in English. Okay, professor. All right. But in Portuguese, you can do that. Then let's learn how to conjugate this verb. All right. Ready? Okay. Repeat after me. Eu sou. Tu eres. Ele, ela, você. É. Nós. Somos eles, elas, vocês são. All right, one more time. Eu sou. Uh oh, tu eres is not used everywhere in Brazil, only in few regions of Brazil. Is uh, used all the time in Portugal, but not in Brazil. Then let's start again. Eu sou, ele, ela, você é, nós somos, eles, elas, vocês são. Muito bem, very good. Now let's learn how to use or when to use verbo ser. Normally students in the U.S. say, oh, ser is used when it's permanent situations. Mm -mm, not really. And I'll explain to you in a minute. But keep in mind that verbo ser is when you describe a person or a thing. For example, ela é senhora very. Or you can say the table is big. A mesa é Grande. You are describing things or people. Use verbo ser. When you are talking about time, horas, you use verbo ser. Also, the nationality. What is the nationality of Mrs. Berry? Qual é a sua nacionalidade? Qual é a nacionalidade? Eu sou brasileira. I am Brazilian, then I am going to use verbo ser. All right, the last one in this list, we have other uses, but the last one on this list is profissão, profession. If you want to say I am a teacher, I am a student, let's say I am a teacher, so professora. I am a student, so estudante. Okay, got it? Then four things you need to remember. Verbo ser is to describe people or things. Tell time, tell where somebody's from, and tell also what is the profession. 
Okay? Enjoy the class. I'll see you in the next presentation. Até logo. Have fun.